I have a question for you. My question is, if today I were to tell you that your dream, your goal, your success, your achievement, that one thing that you want the most in life does exist. If I were to tell you that it does exist right there at the end of a hundred mile walk, if I were to tell you that it does exist right there on top of Mount Everest after a freezing cold 8,000 meter climb, if I were to tell you that it does exist right there across the Saharan desert, the question is, would you walk the 100 miles? Would you climb the 8,000 meters? Would you cross the Saharan desert to get to the other side where your goals, your dreams, your future is waiting for you? That one thing that you want the most. Would you do it? I have a story. Last year I was watching boxing, right? This was in December. There was a match between Dylan White and Derek Chisora. Now, if you know about boxing, you know these two they are heavyweight champions. They were going at it. I'm talking toe to toe. I'm talking punch for punch. I'm talking round after round. Anthony Joshua was the one that was actually commentating on the match. Now he said something, this was in round nine. He said something that really stuck with me, something that resonated with me. What he went on to say was, this is what we call the championship round. Rounds 9 to 12. Championship rounds. This is championship spirit. Now, the moment he said that, my mind just went. Like, I was just sitting there thinking to myself, what does it mean? I was just sitting there trying to understand exactly what it meant, right? And then it hit me. In order to have the things that you want in life, you have to do the things that most people are not willing to do. You have to go through a process that most people are not willing to go through. You have to walk the 100 mile walk. You have to climb the 8,000 meter climb. You have to cross the hot Saharan desert to get to the other end for you to reach your goals. Now, there's a Chinese proverb that says a journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Before you take that step, you have to ask yourself, am I willing to go through the pain? Do I have the patience to go through it all? Do I have the perseverance to go through it all? And most importantly, how bad do I want it? Am I hungry enough? Now this is what it meant. The championship rounds, rounds 9 to 12. If you knock someone out in the first round, in the second round, in the third round, in the fourth round, you've done really well. But the thing is, you have not been tested. You might have got lucky, maybe you got skill. Maybe you caught someone off guard and then you gave them that good knockout punch and they're down on the floor sleeping, right? But when you get to round 9, 10, 11, 12, you will be tested. You will be tested on your strength, on your focus, on your endurance, on your patience. And that's what he meant by the championship round. Simon Sinek went on to say, champion is a state of mind. The truth is, Whatever growth process that you're going through, you are going to fall down, but you have to get back up. You're going to fail and you have to learn. You're going to knock backwards, but you have to come back harder. And that's what championship is. You have to keep going no matter what. Denzel Washington said, I don't want to fall back. I want to fall forward. So no matter what happens, you have to fall forward in the final third of the year. Just like in boxing, 
This is the time for you to bring it home. This is the time for you to show that champion state of mind that you started with. This is not the time for you to give up. If you were going to give up, you should have given up before you even got started. So you got started. Now you have to have that championship state of mind. Now this is the time for you to bring it home. This is the time for you to finish strong. This is the time to dig deep within you and find that last drop of energy. Thank you so much guys. I really appreciate you taking the time to watch my videos. I really do hope that you got so much value from that. And also please don't forget to click the button below and subscribe to my channel. It's a community and it's growing and it's all about just elevating each other. Let's all stay elevated.